Hello YouTube, this is Anonymous Hacker. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make Windows look exactly like Mac OS line, Mac OS X line. Now, to do this, you need a file named Windows 7 to Mac OS X line dot zip. Now, I'll put a link in the description to download this file. Um, this file is of 97.1 MB. So, you need to download this file to make Windows look exactly like Mac. So, after downloading this file, extract the files. So, once downloaded, open the extracted folder. Now, here you could see several files. The first one is for cursor. This is to install the, uh, the cursor style of Mac OS X Lion on Windows 7. Now first, um, you, could you could also see a folder named Desktop Backgrounds. So this contains the backgrounds of Mac OS X Lion. So now you, you select any uh, desktop background, right click and select set as desktop background. So once you're done, go back. Now we, we are gonna install the uh, Mac OS uh, cursors. Just double click on this cursors, and then double click on this file. Click on S. Now click on Next, and install it after installing click on finish now here you are all done here a window will pop up and you need not do anything here you just need to click ok so did you look here the cursor had actually changed into um, mac os style like if you right click um, did you see that it, that loading cursor is also changed into the mac os style now you're all done with the cursors the next step um go to the folder again back now the next thing you need to do is icon packager now open this folder Click on open icon packager. Now run this file icon packager underscore public. Wait for some time. Now install this icon packager. Click on next. I accept. Next. 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 And install it. Once this is done, just need to uncheck this run icon package now and then click on finish. Now open this crack folder, copy this icon package uh, file, click on select copy. Now go to local disk C, program files. Um, it's not program data, it's go to program files and go to the folder named start doc here open this object desktop open icon packager and over here you paste the copied file now here just click on just select copy and replace now after this is done you just um, go back to this uh, icon packager folder now open this icons folder and i windows v2.0 now you copy this uh, i windows uh, folder and go to desktop paste it over there after this is done 
open this icon package uh, and here click on add icon package and select install from disk now you locate the iWindows folder that is located in the desktop and it's over here iWindows v2.0 and select uh, this file and click on open so here is the iWindows v2.0 thing after doing this just click on apply icon package wait for some time Now once you are done you could see that your icons have changed to the max style. Here you could look. Everything is changed the, into the max style that is your icons. So once you are done with that. The next thing you need is you need to install the object dock. To do this first off you need to uh, unlock your taskbar. To do that, right click on your taskbar and uncheck this locked taskbar. After that, right click and select properties. Here, taskbar location on screen and select it top and click on apply. Now you can see the taskbar has shifted to the upper part of the screen. Just click on OK. Now you need to install the object dock plus theme. To do this, open the folder and select object dock underscore free. Double click on this file and wait for some time. Now click on next, next, next and install it. So once you are done installing, just uncheck this one object dock free now and click on finish so now so now copy this folder that is no leopard v2.0 right click and select copy now go to your local disk c go to program files go to start doc go to object doc free go to backgrounds go to zoomers and then paste the folder over here And that's it you're all done now go back and now uh, you just run the object dock once you run the job object dock you, you could see that the object dock appears in the bottom of the screen like this or like this okay after you're done with that go back to your folder And now we are all done with cursors, desktop background, icon packager, object theme. Now the next one is sound packager. Now you need to install the sound packager. Double click on that. Uh, open sound packager and run this sound packager underscore setup file. Wait. For now click on next. Except next, next. Now install it. Once you have done installing the sound packager, uncheck this one sound packager now and click on finish. Now go to this crack folder. Um, this is okay. Now uh, copy this sound packager file and then go to your local disk C program files. Star dock, object dock free. Sorry, go to object desktop, open sound packager, and paste it here. Now just select copy and replace. Now after you you done that.
go back to your sound packages folder open the sound folder and this one you copy this file to the documents and then you just double click on this uh, this file which you have copied that's Mac or SX Now once you have double click on that you could see uh, an option called Mac OS X. Now select that and click on this and now um, uh, select apply en enhanced package. That's it you are all done. Now we could uh, see the sound has changed to the Mac style. Sound, uh, the sound system has changed to Mac style. So now we are all done with the sound packages also. Now cursors, you are done with the cursors, you are done with the desktop background, you are done with the icon packager, object dock is done, sound package is also done. Now next thing is star dock object bar.